love is blind? I just want the best for you. I have a little surprise for her. Attention to details, that's the key. We do it up, we do it right. You know what, I'm just here to make men better. Hi, my name is Joyce and I am a friend of the Petal Leg team. The Latino dads have challenged themselves to take me out on three different dates. Now y'all know when it comes to dating, when it comes to men, I am the harshest critic. Some of my hoes would call me intimidating. So I'm definitely expecting the best of the best from the Latino dads for sure. I'm just excited to get three meals. Am I nervous? No, because I'm a bad bitch, okay? I deserve to be wine and dine. Bring your best because I'm gonna pick who the best date is. I just decided what I'm gonna do with Joyce. She's coming over tonight around 8 p.m. I'm a little nervous, not gonna lie. I gotta go to the grocery store because I just decided this last minute, but you know what? Sometimes last minute plans are the best plans. So the setup is all nice and done. Look, I bought some flowers. So I'm starting to cook now. So I have our charcuterie board. Is that what it's called? Charcuterie board. Okay, so I just arrived to Yvonne's place and I'm gonna go knock on the door. Oh, hello. Hi. Hi, welcome, Joyce. You look beautiful. We're gonna be having dinner very comfy tonight. Wow. Roses. Oh, for you got me roses. Take home with you tonight so you can remember this like, moment forever. What is this? Love is blind? Okay. Spanish bolero. It's, you know, it's it's the Latin version of Frank Sinatra. This is the nicest booty call date. It's a booty call because it's past 8 p.m. It's past 8 p.m. <laughs> a booty call. Hey. It's romantic, right? Wow. Is that a charcuterie boy? This is a charcuterie boy. I know I love charcuterie I know boy. you do. He, he noticed to be on. Attention to details. That's the key. Yeah, I know you mentioned that you like Pinot Noir. Oh. And you got my favorite brand. Oh, this is your favorite yeah, brand for Trader Joe's? Really, yes, yes. Honestly, I did not know that, but you know, soulmates, that's what happened. Ooh, wow. Ooh, heavy pour. We're not paying $50 for white tonight. Hell no, you got two bottles, I, I two see. Bottles. Where are your roomies? Uh, my roomie is currently in New Orleans. So oh, what? Y'all, this is a booty call thing. It worked out perfect. Yvonne <laughs> okay. is the first man to ever give me flowers. Wow, really? This is really great. I feel honored, Joyce. The other two, watch out. You're um, not gonna be the first anymore. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh. But we're not talking about other men tonight, right? <laughs> we're talking about us. Scorpio! We're talking about us uh -huh, tonight. You so. and me, daddy. Surprise me, because I was ready to roast you for having me come to your house on the first date. But you did a good job. From me to you, mate with wow. love. Wow. Wow, sir, you're chef? I a man that could cook? We're having uh, meatballs mm -hmm. with white rice, Ooh. greens, some mm -hmm. greens, and uh, you know, I have some onions. Let's see if this man has what it takes Ooh, okay. to keep me satisfied. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it on camera. We love a, a well-seasoned meatball. It's, it's delicious. Season. I, I used adobo. Ah. Salud, mi amor. Salud, mi amor. Mi vida, man. mi corazón. Espero que esta cena te caiga como yo te caigo. Super bien. Nosotros dos juntitos bebiendo vino, ¿ok? Ok. 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 Muy bien. Wow. It's been wow. real. We're talking a lot. We're talking about our love life, past, mm -hmm. present, and future. Yes. Um, just His life. Goals, what kind of man he is. I got all the tea ladies. You know what, Joyce? I gotta say, that what? I, you've really opened my eyes in a lot of ways. That's what I'm here for. I have you a Scorpio know, moon. You know what? I'm just here to make men better. That's it. Build, build a boo with Joyce. Yeah. I think it's time for dessert. Yeah. Wait, dessert? Yeah. What you got for me, daddy? We got some cheesecake, we got some wine. I have a special performance for you. I'm gonna play you the only four chords that I know on ukulele. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Mm, of course. 
away from the great today. day. It's been a great day. It's been wonderful. Let's give a little update on the dates. I mean, Yvonne was amazing and sweet and really got the vibe, even though I was a little distraught that he was taking me to his house on the first date. I was like, oh my God, what is this? A, a booty call or something? I was very concerned. But it was actually a really fun date and I really enjoyed it. So I was actually supposed to go on a date with Gadiel, but Gadiel forgot and didn't get me a date. So that's minus five points for you, Gadiel. You gotta be prepared for a queen. I hate being stood up. So hopefully you really make your second chance worth it. But now it's time for Eli's date. It's after work. He sent me the info to a brewery, which I do not like. But I'm gonna be open to this date. I'm gonna give chances. We'll see what you got, Eli because I'm a hard judge. So I am waiting for Eli. He says he's walking over. I should dock points because he's making me wait, but it's okay, it's fine. I'll be an equal opportunity home. Wow, Eli. I'm gonna take you to a sports bar, brewery, huh? I mean, this is no, the address. No. Where are you taking me? It's gonna be fun. We're okay. I brought you here because I wanted us to walk along the strip mm -hmm. of downtown Burbank. There's lights, there's people, it's very nice, we can talk. Okay. And I'm going to take you to my number one favorite chicken wing spot because I know how much you love chicken wings. So he's taking me to the chicken wing spot. Yes. I'm happier. What Great. kind of alcoholic drinks do they have? Um, the drinks will come after. So okay. we're gonna do chicken wings, because I know you, you you don't like beer, and unfortunately okay. they only serve beer. So we're gonna grab drinks after. Okay. And then, after all that, we're gonna do some go-karts. Oh. Let's get it. Wow, okay. All right guys, so we're here eating. Blow we'll out the brand, because we didn't get a copyright. But yeah, this is delicious. Right? I was gonna cut some out. Mind. I was gonna cut you out. Ooh. I thought delicious. you were gonna take me to some damn brewery. Hell no, girl. We do it up. We do it right. Chicken mm -hmm. wing lovers, I know uh, you have a passion for this. We're sharing our passions together. He might get points. We'll see. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, God. Oh, oh. Okay, so I am at the bar. Eli's getting us a second drink. And honestly, Eli's killing it. I think this is a really fun date. We still have one more part left. Why are you making that face, Eli? Cause I got you flowers. And the minute I got you flowers, they said we couldn't go race. Yep, they were really like, we're close, we're so sorry. But the guy was nice about it. I just want the best for you, okay? Oh. This night was almost perfect. It is perfect. Yes, it's perfect. You did a great job. Oh man, you know, we figure something out. Yeah, we figure some out. We still got money on the budget. You we, got, money. We, we got money on the budget. So we're at player one. Very yeah. good change Pretty up. sweet audible, right? Yeah. Nice. You did a really great job. <laughs> like I was telling you, you're 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 on a date with like an art home. Like yeah. this is gonna be the game. Drunken video game nostalgia is where it's at. I love it. I love the eighties. I love the vibe. Fun. Yeah, I'm having fun. a blast. Hi right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we are in quarantine as you guys know and I have a date with Joyce. I missed my last date so I'm making it up with Dominican Cuban food. One thing I know about Joyce is that she loves oxtails so I have something special. I have a little surprise for her even though we're in quarantine we still have to make it special. Oh wow look who has time for me. He bought a house and now he's he's ready to be the man he's supposed to be huh. I got something special for you. There's a bartender sitting outside. He's gonna make uh, a drink for you. So make sure you're you kidding. Have him come inside so he can make that drink for you. Hello. This is how it's supposed to be treated. Um, this is how it's supposed to be. Yes. This is what I've always deserved. Though curbside is just. Um... <laughs> this is the Senora Daisy, mm -hmm. and this is named after the owner's mother. Mm. So what this consists of is two different kinds of rum. And then the other ingredients are going to be passion fruit, tamarind, and simple syrup. Put some lemon in there just to kind of mellow out the flavors. He got the torch. Life right now. <laughs> this is what I, I could probably drink a whole cup full. You're really breaking down some like trauma right now. <laughs> <laughs> this 
some trauma from the guys from the past. They like, don't even worry about that. You know what? Why am I wasting my time? If they can't even bring a bartender to my house, <laughs> then why am I wasting my time? Man? This is our Mauricio Yama. Oh, hello. This tastes like labui in drink form with citrus. Labui is Haitian like um, porridge that my dad would make oh, when we were kids. You're bringing back memories. This is a lot. I'm going through. I've had a lot of emotion. <laughs> Did I cry for real? A little bit. This is nobody's business. <laughs> this is what you call a five star date. <gasps> so this is our Rabo Encendido. Mm -hmm. This is our oxtail. Oxtail. Ah, you know I love oxtail. And then it has uh, Maduro's. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is uh, arroz. This is con gris. Mm -hmm. So what that is, it's, uh, it means that the rice and the bean are together. Flan. Oh my gosh. Homemade. The arroz con leche. She makes all the desserts in the house. Dominican arroz con leche. You will not find this type of arroz con leche anywhere here in California. I feel like I'm in the fucking Princess Diaries and I just got my makeover and then everyone's calling me a princess. I literally thought he was going to drop off this food like post me delivery. Salud. Salud. I had a lot of emotions. I mean, you brought the dinner, the high class dining experience of the islands to me, which you know I'm homesick. Yeah. You know, you remind me of home. You remind me of home. I was ready to talk shit. You know, I was in Haitian. <laughs> you were ready for talking. <laughs> so I eat a dog stick. Delicious. All right, I'm ready for, excuse me, this con leche. Wow. I could eat this all day. <laughs> I could eat this shit all day. What I like about this day is that you are showing me, you're not only reminding me of home, but you're showing me new things. You're a player. I'm starting to see. <laughs> I see the game. You give these girls their first con leche. Genuinely love knowing you. I genuinely love you. Yeah. Hey guys. So I know that we went on the dates and I, before I tell you guys who I chose, I want you to tell me how you think the date went. Eli, how do you think our date went? I don't want to sound too confident. I don't want that to affect my chances, but I am pretty damn confident because we went through the highs and lows. We had chicken wings, so I think it was dope. It was one of the best dates I think I had in a long time. What I like about this date is seeing you outside of work, definitely seeing your personality shine and really being flexible with all of the mishaps that happened along the way. You did a great job on the date and it was definitely a good, wholesome, amazing time. Now let's go to Gadiel. The They went phenomenal. You know, uh, at first, you know, the first day didn't happen. I said, I need to make something that's going to be a five-star treatment, even though we're in the middle of a pandemic. Uh, we brought a five-star uh, restaurant to her home. It was a whole complete presentation, and we Damn. both bonded by eating. What? I don't know. It was definitely a great day. Very unexpected. I thought I was going to get Postmates. I told you that. All right, Yvonne. I'm a fan of, like, very cozy dates where we get to just sit down, eat really nice food, a glass of wine, and just talk and just try to connect and bond. And I think that we really did that. Like you were very open. You know, you, very, you opened up yourself and, like, out of the three Latino dads, you're the one, at least from what I from what I know from day to day, it's very hard to get through that Scorpio shell. So, but I do know who the winner is. After drinking vodka last night, I made my decision, and I'm going to have to say, Gadiel is the winner. What? And wow! Wow! Talk about a plot twist right there. With the quarantine, <laughs> oh, Eli was me Gadiel is gonna lose this one. God damn! It. I even said it. I said Gadiel is gonna lose. Oh my! I gotta see this date. I gotta see this date because I me can't too. believe it. I will say this to Joyce: like uh, you are a phenomenal person to get to know. You you made an impact on all of us, no matter what the situation was. So that really shows how like great you are as a person to get to know. And I can't even be mad at you, Gotti, because with all the limitations, you still pulled it out. So I'm 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 proud of you, man. That's that's what's up. Hey, Joyce, we are the lucky ones to have gone on a date with you. Getting to know each one of you through these dates has not only been such a great experience for me, but it also created more standards. You know, you guys are emotional, strong, sensational men. And I hope that you bring that into every romantic situation and to know your worth and to 
really just open yourself up because you guys are so beautiful, all of you. Follow like.